Hello, so if you're looking to add the automation functionality to your YEL uh, locks, uh, like YRD220 or 210, you can open your, your, your locks and if you don't see any green modules there, means it's not compatible to be added to your automation systems unless you buy a Z-Wave module. So this module here is branded AT&T 2.0 CP253. So this is a module that should enable uh, your locks to be added to your Z-Wave controller. So I am using myself a Vera controller. So a Vera controller. So I'm gonna um, I'm gonna add it. So you have to insert this um, module inside the uh, the cartridge inside like that. So now it's inserted. So now it should give you the option to add it to the network. Before, if you try to do it, you don't have number seven in the keypad that's showing up. So let's show you. I have registered the master coder 1237, uh, 1234. So we're gonna access with the master code 1234 pound. And now you have the number seven. If you don't have any module, you won't have seven. You will have only the number six. So now you have seven. So you join the wireless. Press the pound key to continue. So you have number seven. Join the wireless And now network. you can join the press wireless. Press the pound key to continue. So you press one. Join the wireless network. Press so the pound once key you to press continue. When you press pound, it's going to be in inclusion mode. But I'm going to show you on the Vera first what to do. So we're going to put the Vera controller in uh, inclusion mode or all in your other controller. So you go to your device uh, here and add a device. Then you select to add a device. So in that case, it's a door lock. You go here, WYRD220. You click here. So you follow the instruction to pair the device. You can see on the top, it says add device now. So you go to your lock and you put the master code. So now Press that you install the module AT&T, you're going to have number 7. You press set, wireless then module setting mode. pound, join the wireless and join network. the module. So press now you the press 1, join the wireless then network. pound. Then now it's including mode, and now you, you see on top it says device detected, and you can hear detected. Successfully exchange security keys. So now the device is recognized, and it's working almost soon. So we have to wait, then you have to do over here, probably press next. Um, I mean, it's already has been detected quicker than expected, so you can just exit. And you're gonna have to wait for the device to pop up. As you, you can see, please wait on top. So please wait. soon pop up on your screen there we go so now tr success transmit was okay so you can see we integrated a uh, yell uh, touch screen with the AT&T module to the Verac controller Z-Wave so you can see it's successful and now you can even do a test so you can click. I can see I'm pressing the button and then it's turning here from the lock. So it is working perfectly and then here you can see success, successfully pull nut. You can do the other way around. So here I'm gonna press the button to the controller and it's gonna turn.